Peace is coming back. Peace is coming back. Peace is coming back in Jesus' mighty name. Peace is coming back. The Lord was speaking and saying that some people fell out with you when you did not even know what you did against them. They fell out with you when you were just like so innocent. They accused you of what they did not do. They said you were supporting their enemies against them. And then they became so annoyed with you for no good reason. For just no good reason. The Lord is saying that peace is coming. Some people investigated you and realized that you were so innocent. They've inquired about you and realized that you have been so innocent. Now they know that what people told them about you is not true. They see you for who you are right now. They, tr they trust you right now. And can't help but to love you. They can't help but to love you. They are sorry for going against you. They are sorry for concluding on what's not true regarding you. You were trying to make people to love you. You were trying to show yourself a proof. You were trying to like prove a point. Like you are not what they've been thinking. You know what they've been assuming. You know what they've, been, they've heard about. But it's like the, the enemy hardens the heart of some people who were special to you. The enemy's hardened their hearts not listening to you. And they kept on accusing you. They kept on hitting on you. They kept on hating on you. They kept on like talking and saying all manner of things regarding you. The Lord said, my daughter, my son. I have revealed them the true you. Even in their dreams, I have revealed to them the true you. Even with your actions, I have revealed to them the true you. I have caused them to realize that what they did against you was uncalled for. Because God loves you so much. Said his word that if when a, when when a man's ways are pleasant unto him, he makes his enemies to be at peace with him. Your ways have been have been pleasant unto the Lord. God searching the spirit and never found you wanting. Why all the hatreds? Why? The Lord said He had already fashioned you. And people, people don't, people like, they, 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 for no reason, they just developed some hatred towards you. The Lord said, hatred is gone. Hatred is gone. Even if people want to hate you, they can't hate you. They can't, they can't, they, 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 if, if, if people hate you, they can't, they can't be compared to those who love you. Because the word of God says, for those who are with you, are more than against, are more than those who are against you. Those who are for you are more than, more than those who are against you. Hallelujah. You are loved. God has vindicated you. Some people are looking at you. They cannot even come closer to you. They know the truth. They know that you, you are not close to what they've accused you of. But because of shame and pride, they cannot come to tell that they are sorry. But some people are deeply sorry for what they put you through. They are deeply sorry for how they consider you. They are deeply sorry of concluding on things that are not true regarding you. They are deeply sorry for put you through so much pain and heartache. They are deeply sorry for the fact they are remorseful, beloved, believe me. Because God has vindicated you and has, and has shown you the, the true you to them. They know the true you. God bless you. You have been visited. See you in the next video. Hallelujah.